dear student in this lecture video we studied about the definition of scada introduction about scada standard scada configuration the all the three topics comes under second part of the module 1 that is the second part the topic of the second part is scada the first one is nothing but the definition of scada the scada is nothing but the collection of equipment that will provide an operator at the remote location with enough information to determine the status of the particular a piece of equipment or the entire substation or the interconnected power system and cause action to takes place regarding the equipment or network okay scada that is the what is the introduction about scada the scada stands for supervisory control and data acquisition okay supervisory control means what to monitor and control the interconnected power system data acquisition means what we can collect the data okay uh, from the different power systems through uh, remote terminal unit that is rtu uh, with the help of serial communication by scada this is the function of scada the scada refers to a system that collects the data from various sensors at a factory plant or in other remote locations and then sent this data to the central computer which manages and control the data later this is the function of scada the scada system are used not only in the industrial processes for example uh, steel making uh, power generation the maybe the power generation may be conventional energy sources you, energy sources used for power generation or nuclear power generation uh, distribution uh, chemistry and then uh, also in some experimental facilities also the, such as uh, nuclear fission for these purpose la we are used the scada systems the size of the uh, such type of the power plants range from few hundred to several 10000s of input and output channels only in you know, a full and full automatic control only okay then uh, what is scada how the scada is used where it is used and then why okay for what is scada and then how by collecting information from plant or load center by reducing it to the energy management system ems then where the control center both at plant and load then why why we collect the information to gather information as here the information is nothing but voltage current frequency power power means real power and reactive power circuit breaker status that is the whether the circuit breaker is in open position or closed position and to perform the online action for this purpose only the scada used okay then standard scada configuration with a single computer okay